In the aftermath of the earthquake, there was a huge need for building supplies in affected areas of Nepal. The International Organization for Migration became a key provider of shelter and building supplies. This included plastic tarpaulins and corrugated galvanized iron sheets, as well as non-food essentials like blankets and hygiene kits. IOM volunteers took considerable risks traveling during the rainy season to deliver more than 300,000 CGI sheets to villages in heavily affected areas. शुरुमा आउँदा खेरि चाहिँ यहाँ नेरी एकदम दर्दनाक अवस्था देखिराखे थिए मैले भने कुनै पनि संस्थाहरुले चाहिँ जस्ता पाए त बाडेको थिएन मान्छे चाहिँ एउटा तिरपाल नपाएर त्यतिकै छारीमा बसेको अवस्थाहरु देखिएको थियो र यो मास्तिर हामीले पार्ट देख्दै छौ हामी यहाँ तल हाम्रो एकजना भाइ कपिल भाइकोमा बसेका थियौ त्यहाँ जस्ताहरु बाड्ने बाड्दा बाड्दै पनि मास्तिर बाड्दा बाड्दै पनि यो मास्तिरबाट चाहिँ पहिरोहरु आइराखे थियो त्यसबेला चाहिँ मान्छेलाई अरु Chizeruvanda <laughs> Anishanu <laughs> IOM is committed to helping rebuild communities affected by the earthquake and is working to facilitate the construction of safer homes in the future. IOM teams are conducting Build Back Safer awareness trainings and providing toolkits which will help families rebuild their homes safer. <laughs> IOM developed a training program with a series of hands-on trainings and key messages to teach safer construction practices. The trainings consist of safe techniques for building foundations, wall bandings and roof models, as well as the use of simple tools. IOM has delivered Build Back Safer trainings to nearly 3,500 people, including more than 1,300 women in the three heavily affected districts of Dolka, Sindhupalchok, and Gorka. Thank 
गारोहरु बान्नलाई पनि अब सुरको ढुङ्गा गारोले अर्को गारो बान्न पर्ने हुन्छ अनि हामीले चाहिँ अब मिलाएर जस्तो पहिला हाम्रो बाजेहरुले भन्थे नस काठले घर बान्छ भन्थे अब त्यस्तै गरी ढुङ्गाले पनि र माटो अलि हामीले पनि मिलाएर लो चालेर त्यस्तै गरेर हाल्यौँ भन्थे कि घर बन्द हुन्छ